Hey, I'm Corsac, and this is some late night city in Cyberpunk 2077. Hello, V. Jefferson? Listen, I need your help again. Matters private. Sure, okay. What's it about? Not on the hollow. Come by. I'll lay it out. Explain everything. Got your back, Jefferson, not to worry. Great. We'll see you here then. Remember where? Of course. Be there in no time. It's good to see you again. Something happened? <laughs> Come on. Jeff will explain everything. He's just about done prepping for the debate. I've rescheduled all his meetings out of the office today. The office uh, Mike, meeting we're here. We're talking about the so cornerstone of my platform. Us. I'm not doing a U-turn just because doing what exactly? No, I'm not sucking You'll anyone's in dick just so they can fuck me in the ass. Sounds like he's having fun. Look, I gotta go. Make the amendments. We'll powwow later. V, glad you could make it. Jefferson. Keep going. Grab a seat, please. I'll explain why I asked you to come over. We've had a break-in. Not the usual kind, though. So unusual how? A couple of days back, dead of night, something wakes me. A noise. I grab my pistol and come out of the bedroom. See a stranger. He looks like he's about to reach for it. So I pull the trigger. Nail him? No idea. My head started spinning and I passed out. No trace of him the morning after. Okay. I'd like you to find him. Find out what he wanted. Why me, of all people? Wouldn't rather have a detective look into it? Prefer to use tried and tested contacts. Can't blame you. Former mayor's death? You unraveled that mystery. I trust you'll be able to crack this one as well. I still feel like, why not the police? Notify the badges yet? We don't want any buzz around this. No attention, whatever. You know. NCPD's full of people who like the occasional stray eddy. If we reported a break-in, the media descend on us like a swarm of locusts. No badges. Gotcha. Of course, we notified SSI about the incident. Our private security. Am I... bringing the guy who broke in to justice and turning him over to the cops we shouldn't delay too long or am i killing the guy that broke into your apartment let's security look into this say anything this is where things get a little weird they claim there's no sign of a break-in or of a shot being fired security cams didn't record anything guard outside didn't see her hear anything they suggested Jeff must have had a bad dream convenient answer Liz gave security the day off so I could call you in what did the intruder look like because I can't remember much if you're trying to hide me that won't he was wearing some sort of mask or was it an implant I couldn't really get a good look at him Elizabeth didn't see him either I slept through the whole thing. Election season takes its toll on you. Through a gunshot? Said you passed out? That's right. Just after I fired. What then? Nothing. I woke up in bed the next morning. Killer headache to boot. Any idea who you made it back to your bed? Nope. None. Elizabeth's at a loss, too. Great. Intruder, take anything. Break anything. Nothing missing. I haven't noticed any damage, either. Jeff must have scared him off before he could do anything. This security outfit, SSI. Who are they? Been on the market the last 15 years. They have clients across the city. If memory serves, they came recommended. An acquaintance. You think SSI might be behind this? Yeah, they could be, but... Like, there's nothing, it's just what's available. No clue yet. Anyone besides SSI come to mind readily? Walden Holt? He did kill the last mayor. 
And the Poles do have him trailing Jeff. But it could be anyone, really. Jeff has many enemies, a lot of them powerful. <laughs> we could sit here naming names all day. I see. That's why I called you, V. I need you to find out what the hell's going on. Anything else you want to tell me? Or think maybe you should? Hmm. Nope, that about covered it. Liz? It seems like everything. It's unlikely we'll learn anything anyway. Honey, please. I'm sure V'll turn something up. So, you've got all you need for now? V sounds like she's got dread in her voice. It's weird. Wouldn't mind taking a look around the apartment. Of course. Liz can give you the tour. Gotta run to a meeting. As soon as you learn anything, let me know. The voice doesn't sound calm to me. It, it sounds like something's off. Come on. Let me show you around. Right behind you. We can start where Jeff spotted our uninvited guest. I have to admit, sometimes I get fed up with all of this. Politics? So far, we've managed to effectively turn mm. down offers to work with Night Corp, Biotechnica, Arasaka. So far, you say? If Jeff can get elected without owing anybody, favors or otherwise, huh, that'd be the real victory. It seems almost impossible office, in Night City. Control room, storage, and flea market crammed into one. <laughs> this is where Jeff saw our intruder. And fired at him here. Right after walking out of the bedroom. At least that's how he remembers it. Blood stains. Not quite scrubbed clean. Where's the blood from? It yours? I'm 100% sure it's not ours. Maybe the intruders? Probably. If he got shot. Broken. It was fine a couple days ago. We rarely use it though. It's a wall, a lot of TV. Force open. Why is this door concealed? Where? There's no door here. Scanners <laughs> showing something. Really? Different. Wait. You mean here? Right here. It's closed. Previous owners left over, maybe? No. Open it. Somehow, please. Maybe it's worth checking their office downstairs. This was my den before the campaign. A place to focus, relax. Doesn't look good anymore. Security had to set up somewhere. <laughs> One of the many small sacrifices I've had to make. This was the first, but it won't be the last. Oh, well. Not weird. It looks like SSI's employees knew about the break in. Access code to the main room six seven oh nine. Control access. Jesus 
Christ. Think we're safe putting your security at the top of our list of suspects? <laughs> Violated our privacy. Us. Sons of bitches under my own roof. Wonder how long they've been keeping this from you. Too long. This ends now. I am not letting any more of those freaks set foot. Ugh. My head. Something wrong? Don't worry about me. Do what you have to do. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Use meds. Intruder make a beeline here after Jeff tagged him? Talking to yourself again? More and more. Ever since this terrorist started stalking me. <laughs> Weird hardware. What's it for? Connected to the wall-mounted screens. Wonder where else these cables run. Something like this back in the war. Transmitters. Militech was using them. Short range UHF. Signal only travels line of sight, but it can't be intercepted. Line of sight? <laughs> Let's look around him. See if we can't spot where our receiver is camping out. Like whatever else was just pinging on my radar before. Yep. Nope. Got a vision on our receiver. Black van parked next to it. Gotta be our winner. Transmitters within reach of our mystery van. Wonder if Elizabeth has ever seen the car. Liz, this is way bigger than we thought. Jeff's entire campaign could be threatened. Let me worry about the race. Just tell campaign. me what you managed to find. There's a transmitter on the roof. Seems to be conveying a signal to a van out front. Know who it might be? We never set up any transmitter. And I don't know a thing about any van, but my guess is it's SSI's. Don't really see any other possibility. But we still don't know who they work for. So what do we do with the transmitter? Nothing, Nothing. just yet. <laughs> Let me check the van first. I'll wait here. Just don't tell Jeff anything for now, okay? Sure, whatever. I'll call him once I know something more substantial. That's fine. Just remember it's the busiest time for Jeff right now. You can always come and talk to me. Fine, I'll keep that in mind. We are about to find out. Don't lose him, V. Oh, now you're interested. We could expose a corpo conspiracy here, V. I'm telling you. It could be corpo's spies or who the fuck knows what. You look at politicians and see a curated display, but behind the scenes, it's all out war. Citizens don't choose their representatives. Then who? The key players, string pullers. They spy on all the paralysis, look Shit. for weak spots, They're taking us in the north rig side. elections. It's cannon well, Johnny. Why is, why is north side bad news? What, what part of the city have we not just stomped our way through at this point?
Nope. Pierced it, we're in. Couldn't ask the NCPD for better records than this. Pictures, medical records. Vulnerability to neuroplasticity. Hmm. It's some kind of database. Brain scans, the paralysis biological casts, neuroplasticity. Fuck. What about that? The blue shit. Fresh neural links. They're not spying on them, Johnny. They're fucking with their heads. Mean to say someone's literally controlling our upstanding politicians' minds? <laughs> uh -huh. Red blots are memory residue in the hippocampus region. Oh, this is See how they're bleeding dark into the at blue? all. So what are we looking at? They're planting new memories in their heads, modifying their personalities. Oh, this is big shit, Johnny. Fuck me. Got other guinea pigs besides the paralysis, too. Quick, download the data. Whoever comes looking for it. That's your suspect. Shit! They're wiping the data. We've been made. Now well, they yeah, know someone's been in their database. Shit show. We just wonder if down. they also know who. V, do you have any news? gonna want to sit down for this it's it's way bigger than we thought what is <laughs> you are being brainwashed literally they've scanned your minds and now using some kind of conditioning to wait not on the hollow right i'll come by no you and i we need to speak alone let me out I know a little ramen place in japan town sending you the coordinates right See you there. Nice place. Oh. Um, hey. Johnny? Pretty sure they turned your great you spot say? into a slurp shop. Please? I'm ready. Mindless fucking consumerism wins the day again. Oh, here he is. Point for the other team. Huh. Will you see? <laughs> huh. This is why you don't bring back fallen warriors. Sooner or later, they're gonna see everything they fought for is turned to shit. <laughs> uh, I kind of like it. Please. An explosion of chase. Thank you for coming. Go 
cozy little joint. Doesn't really match your style, though. But it's perfect for a one-on-one. -on -one. And it is a cozy little are, place. Then. What is it? I... I'm sorry. My nerves are shot. I can't gather my thoughts. Wasn't that long ago we last met. Something happened since then? No. I mean, something did happen, though not recently. Oh. It's a long story. I don't quite know how to tell it's you. It's gonna be the... Where to even start? I had that one thought that one time where I was like... What if somebody raised my mind and now it's like, oh god. Oh, it actually happens. Relax. No need to rush. Ah. <sighs> uh, uh, a while ago, I started noticing some changes in Jeff's behavior. His personality... He seemed to be changing right in front of me. Becoming someone else. How so? He stopped reading, forgot the title of his favorite movie. Even his musical taste changed overnight. Oh, shit. Is he even in Graham? Once, I said we should visit his brother's grave. And he told me that he'd been an only child. That's when I started thinking something bad was happening. Something insidious. And not just with Jeff. Notice any changes in yourself? After some time, on several occasions, my friends pointed out that I was acting strangely. Oh, that must have been hard. It was. Oh, well, this is this You is know, fucked. it's at times like those you start to question reality. So the whole time you knew what I could end up finding. Ah, I don't know about that. I don't know who, how, or why, but they're changing us. Yeah, I don't that think she noticed until you apartment. called her. What about it? I'm sure I'd seen it before, but must have somehow forgotten. There was a room there in the past. Yeah, it wasn't I that. I find that terrifying. Mentioned any of this to Jeff? I tried. I did. But he's blinded to everything. He just laughed, said I was imagining things. He once brought up a vacation that we never went on, swear to God. He went on about it in such detail, I almost started believing him. Could be just you who forgot. Maybe they just wiped the trip from your memory. Yeah. Hell, I don't know anymore. Don't you get that? Yeah, how would you tell which way that went? Haven't told me the whole oh, story yet, Oh, this is yet, so twisted. I saw a stranger in our apartment one night tinkering with the monitors. But I was in such a state by then that I didn't know if I could trust my own eyes. So, you didn't do anything? I don't remember what happened. I talked to security the next morning. Let me guess. Cams didn't pick anything up. The guy just shrugged and said I must have dreamt it. I mean, with the level of tech involved here, He showed here, me the I recording, like of course. The cameras felt like a lunatic. are nothing. <laughs> and then, the next day, I got a call. Who was it? Them. Whoever they are. There was a garbled voice on the other end. He never introduced himself. Why would they, they threaten you? reveal Try themselves at all. They said I was walking on thin ice. That if we kept stirring up trouble, Jeff could have an accident. Then they wiped any record of our conversation. It was as if it had never happened. So I'm begging you, V. Jefferson can't find out about any of this. Ever. His life depends on it. Oh, man. What if you're just saying what they programmed you to say? Just reading off a script based on thoughts planted in your head. All I know is, I love my husband, and I want him to be safe, and... and happy. Or that's what they want you to know. V, time to you put that, uh, do if you tell him. that 20 intelligence to husband. use. He'll start looking on his own. He can't find out about this. It... it'd destroy him.
But damn it, Elizabeth, you gonna ignore this? Somebody poking around in your heads. What choice do I have? To get myself killed? Or see my husband dragged away from me? Asking me to lie to my employer? Possibly literally. I'm going to tell Jeff that SSI was spying for his rival, Holt. You just need to confirm what I say. Oh man, what are you gonna dump me in the middle of this? And if I'm not on board? You have a choice. Just remember, any consequences will not be yours to deal with. Prepared to fire SSI? Yeah, I'd hope so. Good Truly Lord. prepared to fire SSI? After the threats? Uh, yeah, alright, never mind, yeah. It'd be that's... brave, but risky as I'll get out. What they're doing to us is one thing, but when you found that concealed room, I can't accept strangers spying on us while we sleep. Not under my own roof. What difference does it make where? I'll take full responsibility for anything SSI goes on to do. I'm just asking you not to get Jefferson involved. Mm -hmm. I'll add a meeting in Reconciliation Park to Jeff's schedule. He'll be waiting. Since I can't know if I'll remember this conversation tomorrow, I'm counting on you not to forget what I asked of you. I won't. But that's all I can promise. Oh, man. Goodbye, V. Uh, whole thing's fucked up, huh? Wouldn't want to be in her pants. Speaking of, overlapping memories, changing personalities. Remind you of anything? Yeah, a little too much. But hey, at least we know what we're up against. So, in my pants, what would you do? Some real rat bastards behind this. Someone's got to take them down. Even by risking the Paralysis' lives? Fuck knows what kind of shit a mayor controlled by puppet masters could pull. But yeah, you could end up putting their lives at risk. Or not. Tough choice, V. Yeah? It doesn't matter what you tell him. It doesn't matter what you think of doing or do. You can't change anything. What? We know who you are. We know what you are. We know what you want. You are playing with fire. Don't dare cross the line. Fuck. The hell have I gotten into? Hello, V. Need to talk. Yes, I know. Elizabeth filled me in. Sounds like I was right to hire a professional. Elizabeth, what did she tell you, exactly? Didn't get specific. Just that SSI was spying for that son of a bitch Holt. Guess you got more, though. Fuck. Okay, I'm going to say this from the perspective that right now V is basically the best netrunner in the city and has no idea what they could do to do stop this right now. Is everything all right? Hate this. Strange as it may sound, don't got much. Fuck. There's got to be something. I hate this. You didn't find any hard evidence? Nothing about this sits right. Well, one thing led to another, and some lead was fired. No shit. Between you and those spies? They started oh. it. Burned to a crisp in their own van. Managed to squeeze one of them before... He confessed, but his word isn't worth jack now. Damn. All right. I'll handle things from here. I was hoping we'd make it through this Meaning. without making a deliberate lie. First, I'm going to win this damn election. Then, I'll find the motherfucker who spied on us. And if it was Holt... I'll find every last speck of dirt on him and bury him under the heap. Well, then... Good luck. You'll get your fee soon. You already got my gratitude. Goodbye, V. So, <sighs> thoughts? Hmm, somehow I doubt it's people who are behind this. So aliens. 
Very funny. <laughs> You're too young to remember this, but not so long ago, people talked about rogue AIs prowling cyberspace. So, not aliens. Doesn't matter who or what. Our guys outmatched. They can do whatever they want. Yeah, I don't... He's fucked, V. So are we. 